Hey guys, just making note of this. Uh, more people to add to the false teacher list. But the sister told me about this Bible flock box guy. Well, she just saw him or something. So I just figured I'd just add him. And I've never really checked him out until now. And uh, the first one I watch here, it says 10 facts about hell you're not being told. And he says, number one, that nobody's currently in hell. And he says, no one's currently in hell or heaven until judgment day and he gives a few verses and then he and then he says well you know where are they and number two he says here the dead sleep in the grave <laughs> so it's like every time i turn around on youtube there's somebody teaching like uh you know rank false doctrines and you know this guy he's like highly edited and you know look he's got seventy eight thousand subscribers and he's got his, you know, his YouTube and Facebook and Twitter and I don't know what that is, Instagram or something and Snapchat or whatever. And, uh, you know, add me all over, spread my heresy. This is, wow. Uh, <clears throat> here he's got 10 facts about Satan up here. I wonder what that is. Probably number one's that he doesn't exist or something. Who knows? I don't even want to know, but uh, I'll just have to make note of this guy. Um, but yeah, I, I can't. I don't know a lot of verses off the top of my head, but you know, Paul said that, uh, you know, that he would be, you know, if he he he'd be absent from the body and present with the Lord, you know, when he dies. So I mean that that can't be talking about soul sleep. I'm I'm pretty sure what he's teaching here is like soul sleep. I don't know if he's a Seventh Day Adventist or what, but uh, I made a video about that and uh, I need to get a page together on that actually. But you know it says Elijah was taken up to heaven. Um, you know we know that I don't know Moses and Elijah they appeared with the Lord, in the Mount of Transfiguration. You know, I don't think they were uh, just sleeping in the grave. And, you know, of course, there's the parable of uh, where Jesus speaks about Abraham's bosom, the guy being taken to Abraham's bosom, which I believe is in heaven, and I'm going to hopefully get something out on that soon. But uh, I do think it was a parable, but I think there's some truth in that too. Uh, I mean, it's it's all truth, but I mean, I think that some of it could be taken literally, I guess is what I should say. And, uh, you know, he says that, the rich man went to a place of torment, and that is hell. And uh, I don't think that he was saying, uh, you know, that this isn't going to happen until Judgment Day or something. I think he's saying, like, this stuff's already currently happening, and you want to avoid hell. But uh, I'm sure there's plenty of other verses. You know, Jesus told the thief on the cross he'd be with him in paradise. He didn't say, you know, you'll be with me in soul sleep. Um... <laughs> So, there's just, there's a lot that, that could be used to refute that, but man, here's another guy, a whole bunch of subscribers, pumping out videos, and straight up false doctrine. But, uh, anyways, just make a note, and if anybody knows anything else about this Bible flog box, you can share that. Uh, I might just make a page on the forum about him right now, just to make a note of it, and then... I'll add him on the website later on. But, uh, okay. God bless. Oh. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay.